Today, we're gonna do our first like fitnessy video, mm -hmm. and it's gonna be a booty workout. So Priscilla's been getting more into working out, so I've been getting her to work out. I've been writing her out exercise plans. Actually, if anybody doesn't already know this, I'm a certified personal trainer. So yeah. I don't know if y'all know that. Point is, is that since she's been getting into working out and stuff like that, we thought that we'd show you some of the workouts. And today we're gonna do a glute workout because yeah. that's the thing that every girl cares about more than anything else. <laughs> Says you. So yeah. you, it's like, baby, you wanna work out your arm? No, I wanna work out my butt. Baby, you wanna work out your calves? No, I wanna work out my butt. Baby, you wanna like do abs? No, I wanna work out my butt. So we're like basically completely different. Like he works out every day. All the time. All the time. For like three, four hours sometimes a day, even more. I am like, I barely ever work out. Like I just now am starting to finally get into it and being consistent with finally. it. Before I met him, I was like always like really, really underweight. Like I was like 90 pounds like all the mm. time. And then I met him and I got to 100 pounds. And then like after that, it's just been every freaking month, like increasing, increasing. I gained so much weight over quarantine. But you still look good. Thank you, baby. You have to say that you're my boyfriend. That's not true. Yeah, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Definitely not. <laughs> after quarantine and all that, like I finally hit like 131 pounds. Wow, you really putting your business out there. I'm putting out it there. out like there. That. I'm putting like it that. out there. I finally got up to 131 and like for those of you who know me that's like a really really big deal to me i usually walk around like five percent body fat all year round and then like quarantine hit and i was like i need to like relax for a little bit so i let myself put on a little bit of weight feel comfortable More like and then i don't know what happened but somebody decided to be like i'm gonna like relax a little bit too so today we're gonna show you um Basically what she what does doing, for her yeah. leg and glute workouts today mm -hmm. um and i'm gonna go through it with her it's gonna be fun we're gonna yeah. have fun with it we're gonna work out together so it's kind of like a couple-y fitness yeah, yeah, it's vlog, like a but couple like journey. couple vlogs <laughs> slash like good leg workout for like anybody guys girls or whatever yeah i basically just want to transform my body so let's work out yeah Woo! what we're gonna do baby so we're going to start off the exercise with lunges which are the worst exercises in the whole wide world. I hate them. Like, I'd rather do 100 squats than lunges. But they're the bummest exercise for they're your butt. They're so bad, I hate they're them. They're the best thing you do for your butt, baby. I hate them. Like, maybe like on par with like, a glute bridge. She's gonna do some lunges with some 20 pounds. Yeah. Um, she's gonna do like 12 on each leg. Excuse me? Yeah, it's time to up it. No. It's time to up it, let's go. Oh my God. Most important thing when doing any leg exercise is to make sure that you have your whole foot flat on the floor. We can't have those heels come up. Give me 12, come on, finish it out. Oh my God. <laughs> That's a good one. What do you do? I don't know. <laughs> You're so much more balanced than I am. Yeah, go nice and slow. I absolutely hate lunges, if you guys didn't already know I that. I hate them too. Honestly, I think they're probably like the most hated exercise in all of like exercises. <laughs> Come on. Do good. Give me a kiss. That's one. Two. Dude, I can't do that. Oh my god, it's too hard. Three. <laughs> come on, come on. If I'm too tall, I gotta go in the back. <laughs> I'm still too tall. And go. Ready? Ah! Round two? 
buddy, do it. Are we done? We're done with lunges. Oh. Hello up there. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna do uh, bridges, okay? Yes. So if you don't know what bridges is, when you're laying on your back and then you just push your hips up and hold. Pretty okay. much, yeah. Um, you can do those going up and down. You can hold at the top. Um, you can do it with weight, put it in the middle. So these are really, really effective at targeting the glutes. Um, this is the simplest way to do it at home. What we are gonna do is we're gonna use 25 pounds. We're gonna hold it for a minute and then we're gonna do some reps at the end of it. So it's gonna like burn like a mother after. So it's like a minute of hold and then 30 seconds of just up and down, up and down, up and down. Go! Damn, why are you touching me? <laughs> Away from me! I love you! I love you! I love you! We're doing squats now. A lot of people like to start the workouts off with squats. Yeah. Personally, I think it's best to do uh, your lunges first. Really try to like connect with your butt. Um, mm -hmm. Then do the bridges, just really tire out your glutes, right? And then after that, then do your squats because they're already activated and they're like ready to feel it and do all the work. Mm -hmm. So you go slow, you really feel it a lot more in there. Yeah. Just trying to like get every little bit out. It's really important that you have your feet shoulder width apart, okay? So she's always gonna have her feet shoulder width apart. Make sure your heels staying down, right? Knees apart, everything. We don't want any of this weird stuff. Now we're gonna go slow. Don't like slam the dumbbell on the ground. Good. How many you got? Three. Three, four. Baby, no! Five, it helps you connect. It helps you connect. No! Baby, ah! It's actually an old bodybuilding thing to like have somebody actually tap and touch the area that you're trying to feel it in, um, so you kind of connect more with that muscle. Just saying. So. He just wanted to touch my butt. Come on, bro. Squeeze that sucker at the bottom, right there. You want to squeeze it down there. All right, next up, we're gonna do some back kicks. Uh -huh. All right, uh -huh. so we're gonna push the leg back up into the air. Yeah. And you're gonna make your booty butt cheeks hurt. Okay. Nice, make sure you kick it outwards a little bit. Squeeze at the top. You wanna squeeze and hold for like three seconds. The top's the most important part on these. Unless you have a cable system, you're not gonna have constant tension at the bottom. So you really wanna take advantage of the top. Make sure your core is stable so you're not going diagonal or anything like that. On a nice, steady, strong core. Gotta stabilize. Feel it in your butt? Yeah. A lot? Yes. Come on, squeeze. The higher you can get it without moving your core and just really focusing on contracting your glute, the more it's gonna wanna grow. Damn, you look good. Mm. <laughs> I, need, I need to start doing some of these for me. Hit some hip abduction. Oh, oh, what the? F so we're gonna do some hip abduction. And we're gonna like these, lift these joints up into the air, put some ankle weights on, stuff like that. If you don't got ankle weights, you can also put a weight like right on your your side. Yeah. Um, or honestly, you really don't even need weight. You can just like hold that sucker forever. All right. And we're gonna push it up and back towards me, but keep your hip forward. Good. That's it. Mm -hmm. Focus on hitting those abductor muscles. Good. What? what is going on with you? I almost fell. I 
promise this doesn't happen often. No, this is what happened. I've been letting her do this on our own for a little bit. Clearly, <laughs> clearly somebody's been slacking. Hips forward. Push your hip forward to like into my knee. Like, there it is. Now go up. Feel that? Oh my god. Huge difference, right? One more, one more, ready? Right? Hold, oh, hold, 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 you did. And I came here and did another whole leg workout with you. Right. And I'm still not tired. I've been basically doing like lower body Tuesdays, upper body and lower body, either Thursday or Friday, and then upper and lower body Sunday. So I'm hitting upper body and twice. lower body twice. And then, no, yeah, lower absolutely. body. You're basically hitting like legs three times. Yeah, and, and upper then body you're twice. And upper body like twice. Yeah. And you're hitting abs like twice. Yeah. Yeah. But like it's gonna change. Like you can't just do the same thing all the time because your body adapts. And once it adapts, it's like you'll feel it, but you won't get anywhere. It's just like you're maintaining what you already gained from it. So you gotta either increase the weight or maybe even change the frequency of stuff. So basically the workout that we just did today, I'm going to be putting in the description below. So if you guys wanna check that out and follow it along, do it and at copy home. Copy and paste whatever it. Whatever the case is, it's there for you guys to see. So we're gonna put what weight she did with the rep scheme and sets that she did. Right. If you guys wanna change it, you can. I definitely recommend keeping the sets the same. Um, mm -hmm. But definitely change the reps. Like if you're somebody who can only do five lunges with your own body weight, just do five. Yeah. Um, but yeah, if you wanna go a little bit heavier cause you're just that kind of person who likes going heavier, you can just use a heavier weight, just do lower rep range. Mm -hmm. But you gotta kinda get close to that failure range for it to be effective. Like you can't just be sitting there doing like, oh, five, five. <laughs> not gonna work, right? I so wish it worked Definitely that way. customizable to you guys. Just, you know, take it as you feel. But pretty much you just do this consistently two to three times a week like in like i want to say like a month to three months you'll probably notice extreme difference in your strength the way you feel um the way you look you probably build more muscle if you're eating right i think that our next step is maybe to do a core workout yeah you do like a core workout or the upper body workout that you do you can yeah. show them what you do for that all right so we're done for the day guys so please remember to like and subscribe yeah. comment down below with all those shout outs of what you want to see next in a mm -hmm. fitness category or anything else yeah all right so we'll see you guys next week bye oh my god wait show me your butt no show me no that way they can see the pump no no no, no. 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 no.